So the Sol Ross Meat Market is set up as a learning space for students. They are able to come in and be hands-on all the way through harvest and then into the retail end of it. We actually have a retail counter at the meat market that allows uh, the public to come in and buy cuts of beef, lamb, uh, goat, and pork. Um, and all of that has, is connected to the students' learning. So we make sausage, bacon, um, they're, they're fabricating the prime cuts of steak like T-bones and ribeyes and learning how, how, how a quality product is made. Hi, I'm Rosemary Kettering. I'm the manager at the Sol Ross Meat Market. I've been here since March. I came here from South Dakota. I'm originally from Minnesota, Wisconsin area, and I'm happy to be in West Texas. So Sol Ross has uh, livestock through their sustainable ranching program. And with that, we're able to procure those animals and use those animals through to the retail space. And we're able to micromanage uh, a lot of the management. We know where that animal's coming from when it's being fed. We can work with the people involved in that and then get a quality product to the counter. We also are able to add dry aging uh, at a length that is a lot longer than most people can afford to do just because of our space. So that dry aging always adds value to that cut, making it more tender and more flavorful. Um, our prices are competitive. We, we don't try to undercut anyone part of our community, but when it comes to the cuts you can get, you are gonna get any cut that can be taken off of a beef animal here. We're able to go through and use all of that up, even when you have people who are used to uh, going and having beef processed, don't always get all the cuts back. There's a lot of just putting certain cuts into trim and, and grinding it for hamburger. Here, we're able to teach the students how to take out some more of those more um, new cuts. They're not really new, but when you start separating out muscles, uh, our students can start doing that and you're gonna see more of the you know, cuts like flat iron or the tri-tip, which is popular in other areas. Technical positions like this or technical um, uh, skills like this are never gonna go away and they're always gonna be useful. It's kind of like the bartender. You know, once you learn that, any community can use that skill.